guys so happy 4th of July and um, I've made a few 4th of July things and today I'll be showing you how to make this one the triple single so let's get started the items I'll be using today are my loom in the staggered configuration my rainbow loom hook red white and blue bands and any kind of hook I'll be using the S clip First thing we're going to do is take our red band and place it from the left peg to the center. Next, take our white band and place it from the center peg up. Next, take a blue band and put it on the right peg to the center so that it looks like this. Next, you're going to take some red bands and you're going to place them all the way up this row right here. Gonna grab some more red bands. Once you get to this peg right here, you're gonna go from that peg to the center peg. Just like that. Then you're going to go down the middle row with white bands. And this one, you're going to just go all the way up that row, up to this one. And place it just like that. Then you're going to go up this row with blue bands. Once you get to this peg, go from this one to this one. So now you should have this. Next, you're going to need four sets of red, white, and blue bands. So you're going to take your first red band, and you're going to come back to the other side and put it right here. Then take a white band and place it on the next one. Take a blue band and place it on the next row. And so on. A red band and a white band and finally a blue one. Red white, and blue. One last set. Red, white, and blue. So now your loom should look like this.
Next, you're going to put a cap band around this peg right here. So you're going to take your band, stretch it out, wrap it around your finger so it has three loops. Take it and put it on the peg. Like that. Make sure to put the cap band on the peg that's like this and not the one that you started from, not the one with the arrow. So now it's time to loop. So you're going to go inside of the cap band and grab that first blue band. Grab it on your hook, pull it through, and loop it to the left peg. Next, go in the cap band, grab the white band, loop it forward. Then, go in, grab the very last red band, and loop that right. So now you should have this. Next, you're going to go in on this peg right here, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. Go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. Go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. I'm going to do this with you four more times, and then I'm going to show you what it looks like when I'm done with this row. Go in, grab the bottom band, just get it on my hook, and loop it forward. Go in, grab that bottom band, and loop it forward. Go in, grab that bottom band, and loop it forward. One more time. Go in, grab that bottom band, and loop it forward. Now I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done with this row. So now you should have something that looks like this. On this row, teardrop shapes. When you got to this one, you're just going to go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it to this one. Now you're going to do the same thing to the middle row. So I'm almost done with the white row. Forward, bottom band, loop it forward, okay. Now we're on to this one. So you go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward to that center peg. Now you're going to come back, and you're going to do it to the red side. So just go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. Go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. In, grab the bottom band, and loop it forward. I'll be right back when the red row is done. So once you get to this peg, you're going to go in, grab the bottom band, and loop it to the center one. Just like that. So this is what your loom should now look like. So 
So now we can finish off the bracelet. You'll need a white band and your hook. So come to this end right here where all the bands are on. Go in and put your hook through all of them. Grab that white band, hook it on to the hook, grab it with your hook. After you've grabbed it, pull it through. And hook the other end onto the hook. Just like that. Slide it up to the thicker part of your hook and you can begin taking it off. As you can see, this band should be holding all of the other rubber bands. If it's not, you may want to redo it. Go ahead and just take off your bracelet. Some people like to just rip it off. I like to take it off one by one so it doesn't get as stretched out. You can do whatever you'd like, however you want to take it off. And there you go, you have your triple single uh, 4th of July bracelet. Now, if it's not big enough for your wrist, probably not, let's make an extension. So what we'll be doing is basically making a single and then attaching the bracelet. So the first thing you're going to do is take a red band and put it right here. Next, take a blue band like this, and a white band, and then repeat. Red, blue, and white. I usually like to do about nine bands. And now, don't do the last white band. You're going to take your bracelet, take it off of the hook, put it on your finger. So if, if you let go of this, the whole bracelet will fall apart, basically. So um, don't let go of that. Take this right here that's hooked onto your bracelet and put it as the next band on there. So now... You're going to loop everything together. So you're going to go just like a single. Go in. Grab the bottom band. Loop it over and loop it over and loop it over. And I'll be right back. So I've already done the first three. Now you're gonna, I'm going to do the rest with you. So you're going to go in. Grab the band. And loop it over. Go in. Grab the band. Can't quite get that one on my hook. There we go. And loop it over. Go in. Put it on your hook. And loop it forward. And just keep doing that. Now's the time when you're going to use your clip. So the first thing you're going to do is come over here, take your clip, and clip it onto this red band, like this. And go ahead and just take that off. After you've taken that off, come over here, find the cap band. And I already put a clip on here. I'm just going to take that one off and put your S clip or C clip onto there and there you go you've made your triple single thanks for watching happy 4th of July